My name is Nicholas Leggett. I work for the Transportation Research Center on the Transportation Education Development Pilot Program, also known as TDEP. Um, this is a grant served by the Federal Highway Administration to administer uh, four strategic interventions to bolster the transportation workforce here in Vermont. Um, the transportation workforce here in Vermont and nationally is experiencing a series of challenges, the most pressing of which is that um, the uh, transportation workforce is disproportionately comprised of baby boomers, so it's a graying workforce, which means in five to ten years, roughly 40 to 60 percent of the transportation workforce is slated to retire. Um, that and younger educated people are um, competed for aggressively by other industries and also um, entry level positions require technical skills that there aren't a lot of opportunities to gain out here in Vermont in a rural state like this. So the four strategic interventions that we have implemented here as part of the pilot program, the first of which is um, second careers in transportation. And what we're doing here is um, we've created a policy document that aims to help transition um, older workers from industries where they have applicable skills such as construction or any type of office setting to um, a mode of transportation or a transportation enterprise here in Vermont. The uh, second strategic intervention is a community colleges program. Here at, in um, Vermont we have the community college system which operates throughout the state and we've implemented this um, associate's degree in uh, transportation operations which aims to help people who are already in the industry gain the soft skills they need to be supervisors and managers. Um, the third strategic intervention is the Transportation Systems Academy. And what that does is that is a program that um, has modules that give students technical credentials at area uh, career and technical centers. And this is also applicable to adults as well. Um, and so when they come out of this program, they have their OSHA certification, they have their flagging certification, they get CPR, they know basics of maintaining a good road. And we've been able to um, have the Agency of Transportation recognize these credentials as um, preferred credentials. So when they apply, they're put at the top of the list of applicants. Um, and then our final strategic intervention is the Transportation Systems Institute. This um, is a program that is aimed towards professionals who are already in the industry and what that does is it provides them with leadership skills and um, helps them helps guide them with succession planning. These are usually older workers who are these baby boomers that we were talking about before who are going to be retiring in the very near future and so having them focus on pulling people up behind them as they exit the industry is very important. And so the overall, the overarching theme of these four interventions is that what we want to do is we want to align policymakers, workforce training, academic institutions, and industry so that we have a comprehensive um, workforce development strategy. So that is our pilot program.